Thank you for choosing the three-wheel electric service vehicle from Cushman. This vehicle has been designed to operate in a warehouse or factory environment with semi-smooth floors, roads, and ramps. Although the vehicle has been designed to provide safe and reliable operation, maintaining good performance depends to a large extent on the operator. Today we're going to help you understand the vehicle, its equipment, and how to use it safely. Let's get started. Before initial use, the batteries must be fully charged. Connect the charger cord to an outlet that has been properly installed and grounded. The power, AC cord, is equipped with a grounded plug. This vehicle is equipped with an onboard charger that is wired directly to the batteries, only requiring it to be plugged into a dedicated 15 amp AC outlet to be operational. When charge cycle is complete, replace cord in appropriate area under the seat. Warning: Hydrogen gas is generated as a natural part of the lead-acid battery charging process. A 4% concentration of hydrogen gas is explosive and could cause severe injury or death. Never smoke around or charge batteries in an area that has an open flame or electrical equipment that could cause an electrical arc. The controls, meters, and switches consist of a key switch, direction selector switch, power on battery condition meter, headlight, service parking brake pedal, speed control pedal, horn, seat switch, and an hour meter. Make sure you are properly seated in the operator's seat. Make sure the direction selector switch is in the neutral position. Apply the parking brake, if it isn't already applied, by depressing the front portion of the service parking brake pedal. Insert the key in the key switch and turn it to the on position. Move the direction selector switch to the desired direction. When the direction selector is in the reverse position, a warning signal will sound. This is a device to indicate the vehicle is ready to run in reverse. Releasing the accelerator slows the vehicle. To stop the vehicle more quickly, depress the brake pedal. To avoid component damage, the vehicle must be brought to a complete stop before shifting the direction selector switch. On steep hills and ramps, it is possible for vehicles to coast at faster than normal speeds that may be encountered on a flat surface. To prevent loss of vehicle control, speed